Hey guys, it's Wednesday afternoon um, and I've just left work. Um, so I'm getting out a little bit early today because I've got to get home and pack because tomorrow I fly to Brisbane for Dale's event. So that's very exciting. Looking terrible today, sorry. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna go home and throw some stuff in a suitcase because I'm up super early in the morning. I'm gonna do the school drop for my kids and then straight out to the airport. I'm gonna fly to Brisbane and I'm gonna be on the ground in Brisbane for 20 hours and then I'll fly back Friday and go straight to work from the airport. So busy couple of days ahead. Super excited uh, for Dale's event tomorrow night at Fendi. It's gonna be great. Um, stocking up on the coffee because I'm really gonna need it over the next couple of days. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd take you guys with me and you can come to Dale's event and see how that goes. Um, so yeah, let's go home and pack. Okay guys, I think I packed. So this whole side of my suitcase, my Remoa suitcase that I bought in New York in rose gold, which I love. It's the best color ever. Um, this is stuff I've got to take for Connor from the closet. And then this side is just my stuff. So realistically, if I didn't have to take that stuff, I could have got it in a much smaller suitcase, probably carry on. But hey, I love check luggage. Um, so you can see I've got my new Gucci toiletry pouch and beauty bag, uh, beauty case, which I promised you guys I was going to give a workout. So that's why they're coming. I've got my niece BB, which I always travel with. No packing cubes this time because really I don't have that much to take. Um, my makeup brushes. I'm not taking a lot of makeup because I'm actually getting my makeup done at Mecca. Um, so hopefully I won't actually need anything in this because I'm not wearing makeup up there just in case I don't have time, um, before the appointment to take makeup off or I can't get into the room. And then I've just got some clothes to wear back the next day. Over here is my dress that I'm wearing to the event tomorrow night and with my Fendi blazer and my <clears throat> Louis Vuitton sneakers that I plan to wear tomorrow that I need to relace because I am old school and I can't stand it when they lace them these ways. So that is my suitcase all packed and ready to go. I've got to go pack my Neverfull with the stuff I'm taking on the plane. So let's go have a look at that. Okay, so this is my Neverfull all packed and ready to go. I have my Fendi sunglasses that I'm taking. I have my Fendi first that I'm going to carry tomorrow night. I've got a sneaky little thing in there for Dale to give her. My mini pochette, which has my car keys and my house keys. My full size wallet because I'm too lazy to change out of it. Panadol, highly important. And this I am using as a catch all at the moment and has like lipstick and lip balm and all the other essentials in it. I'm also going to throw in my Five Stages to Style book. So this is all the course materials for the Five Stages to Style course I'm doing that Dale from Dale's Diction just finished. I have printed them all and bound them and I'm going to take them on the plane with me tomorrow to have a read. So I will throw them in there as well. So I think I'm packed. All right, I will see you guys bright and early in the morning. Morning. So I have managed to get myself out of the house and I have managed to get my children to daycare and vacation care. So I'm now gonna head out the airport. Fingers crossed there's not too much traffic. Fingers crossed I can find parking. Like, yeah, I'm on a 10 a.m. flight and it is 7.30. So it may be a push all comes down to traffic in Sydney. Um, you'll notice I'm not wearing any makeup. That's because as soon as I get um, to Brisbane, I've got to check into my hotel, go straight to Mecca and get my makeup done. And they want me to come with no makeup on. So it's easier to travel without it. And I don't care that much. So let's go do battle with Sydney traffic. Thank you. 
so we have made it to the domestic airport i had a good run for traffic which i never say in sydney <laughs> so i'm not happy about that um i'm just having some um light breakfast and then i'll board and head to brisbane so yay it's exciting so yeah let's uh let's go at well I think it's just a corner room actually it's not a suite this time because I'm barely here um, at the W Hotel in Brisbane so as we walk in there's the bathroom with the big metal tub and you can see my luggage is already up here come around we've got a little bar little desk there's the bed and I'm overlooking South Bank in Brisbane, so over the river. So it's nice. I'm barely going to be here because I've got to get up super early to get back out. So I thought it was more than enough. And let's just flip you guys around. You can see my makeup. So I went. So I went down to uh, Mecca in Fortitude Valley um, and the lovely Soraya, in case you're a local, did my makeup and I love it. She did a fantastic job. I've got makeup on, but I don't not look like me, which is always a problem. Sometimes you might get someone who's over ambitious with your contour and suddenly you don't look like you anymore. But I think she did a fantastic job. Oh go over into the light a bit more oh that's a lot of light oh that's a lot of light there we go so yeah lots of highlighter which is what I wanted love this blush but of course it's um out of stock at the moment Damn it. um but yeah I think she did a fantastic job so super excited about that I am now going to attempt to um, have some kind of a shower without touching my face and do my hair and get dressed and then head back into the city and catch up with Connor from the closet before the event. Um, and yay, it's exciting. So let's go do that. So I'm just sitting here in Cafe 
Cafe above Fendi. I'm all ready to go. I'm dressed and I'm having a mojito, <laughs> um, which is going to get me real drunk real fast because I have no alcohol tolerance whatsoever. Um, Connor from the closet is going to be here any minute and we're going to have some dinner before we go to this event and I will see what kind of footage I can get for you guys. Bye. Look who I found! Oh, hi guys! <laughs> Hello everyone! <laughs> I found my people! So we're here for Dale's event, so we're going to go downstairs in a minute and I promised you I would take footage and I will. to Dale for all the effort that you've put in to get this ready as well. Um, you've gone to a lot of trouble, so I know that. Um, so far, it's been a fantastic evening. I hope everyone's enjoying themselves. Um, as Dale said, we've got some incredible pieces that a lot of you may not have seen in Brisbane before. So please feel free to try things on. That's what we're here to do, is to enjoy the beautiful products that we've brought here for you. So enjoy the evening. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Dale's event. I'm a little tired, but that's okay. It was a great event. Um, I met 
so many people and it was just the most humbling thing to have people come up to me and go, I watch your YouTube channel. So thank you to everybody who took the time during Dale's event to come and introduce themselves to me, who um, told me that you loved my channel. I was so appreciative and so humbled by that. Um, I know that Dale had a really great time and everyone there was lovely and lots of people picked up some beautiful items from Fendi. Did I shop? Maybe. Maybe, maybe you'll have to stay tuned for the unboxing to see what I got. Um, but I did get this little goodie bag. So I thought, well, um, I wait for my hair to dry so I can go to sleep. I would quickly um, take the things out for you so you could see. So this was a mix of what Fendi gave us as a gift bag and what Dale herself put together. Um, so we have a little bottle of Maui. Everyone got a little bottle of Maui. And we got, what else did we get? Um, sorry. We got oh, cookie. That'll be handy in the morning when I don't have time to eat breakfast before my flight. And oh, another cookie. And what else is in here? And oh, cool. A uh, little poppet phone grip um, for your phones. So you can put them on the back of your phones. That's cool because I actually do use one of those. So I will most certainly be using that. And then a little box. And I suspect this is the one that comes from Dale. So let's do a quick open. Oh, and it comes in a little bag. And if I can open it one handed, maybe. Yes, yes, I can. How's that for skill? And we have, <gasps> look, it's a handbag holder with Dale's picture on it. Dale's got merch. So that's very cool. So everyone who came tonight got one of these um, and mine will live in whatever handbag that I am carrying at the time. So super handy. Um, and then there's a little card from Dale. Uh, oh, it's got her sticker on the back. I assume it's a card from her. And it says got Dale's picture on the front and it says thanks so much Dale so a little goodie bag so tiny unboxing to finish off the night before I go to sleep um but yeah lots of fun stuff it was a great night um I like to think everybody had a good time I vlogged what I could but I was also trying to have conversations with people um, and everyone was just so, so lovely. And it was lovely to meet people that had, um, interacted with me in, um, comments or who have their own channels. And I actually got to meet them in person. I met Adam from Adam's House of Style. Um, I met Lucinda from Yellow Chic Road. Um, there was Narelle from Narelle's Handbags there. Um, a whole heap of amazing people. I will tag them all in the description box down below in case you would like to follow them. Um, couple of the Fendi enablers that Dale and I are part of the group with. Surprise Dale. So that was lovely to see Sapna and Nadia come up. So I know how much Dale appreciated that and I was super excited to see them too. And yeah, it was just a great, great night. So I'm going to try and get some sleep. It's like 11 o'clock now. I've got to be up at five to go back out the airport and jump on a plane. Um, I'll vlog a little bit on the way home, but um, it's not going to be very exciting <laughs> when I get back to Sydney. I'm sure it's going to be raining because it has been and I've got to go straight back to work. So no rest for the wicked around here, but stay tuned. I will unbox the things that I bought. So that's it, guys. Night. Another day, another coffee. Um, I have gotten up super early. I was up at five, out of the hotel at 5.30 in an Uber and um, out to the airport. Um, my flight's at eight. Um, 
And yeah, it was a great night. Tired, but super happy to have been here for Dale and I got to see Connor and all these wonderful people. So it was well worth the 20 hours on the ground in Brisbane. Um, I think it's probably going to be raining when I get back to Sydney because the weather down there has sucked for days. So um, I'll be leaving the beautiful sunshine of Brisbane for the rainy, rainy weather of Sydney. Well, that's right. Be good to get home with my family um, and unbox some stuff for you guys. So yeah, hang about. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Um, I hope that you will hit that subscribe button down below um, and come join me here on a regular basis. Um, if for no other reason than you want to see what I bought at this event, um, come follow me over on Instagram. I put things up in real time over there. Um, and yeah, I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.